Hey, hey, all you lady dragons out there. It's me, Jess the Dragon. Well, I'm not Jess the Dragoness anymore. It's me, Jess. Thanks for coming to check out this video. So we have another she in men's and women's haul for you guys. So say hello to everybody. <laughs> if you guys don't remember here from last time, this is Bay. This is Bay. He's going to be trying on some she and men stuff. And of course, I'm going to be trying on the women stuff. So, um, what type of stuff did we get this time? I feel like we just got like casual stuff or random. Random. Yeah, it we, was random. It was We're going to be more coordinated next time. Okay, right. But so, enjoy the random. <laughs> <laughs> it's a random haul for you guys this time, but hopefully we got some winners. We're going to go ahead and try some stuff on. So let's, you want to show them the box how much stuff we got? We got a lot of stuff. So the box is pretty big. We got a bunch of stuff. So we're going to jump right into it. I think some of this stuff will be appropriate for fall because we didn't get like shorts or anything that's no. for warm weather. We got like more cold weather. Hoodies. Uh, yeah. Uh, workout gear somewhat. Right. Okay, it's kind of a mishmash. Yeah, it's just a mishmash. All right, so we will get started with the first one. All right, so this is the first outfit. So like we said, I think this is more like a casual type of haul. This is a workout set. Um, I think this workout set is okay. I like the top. I like that it has the thumb holes. I like workout sets like this. The only thing that I don't care for about this set is the booty part. It's like a little too much exaggeration on the booty part. And so I just don't super feel comfortable. I doubt I would even wear this outside. I'm like, I didn't realize that I had ordered one like this. I thought this was just a regular um leggings but this is the leggings that has like the it, it actually has something inside this this um seam has like a scrunch down thing that like pushes it into your i don't know anyway it's the color is cute the fabric is really nice quality it feels good i love the top i would never wear the bottoms outside how about yours it doesn't match well i don't know what i was going for but the pants feel good. They're kind of short, but they feel nice. And they it's, stretch, right? Yeah, they're stretchy. That's nice. And uh, I'm not sure exactly what I was going for with the shirt. I think I may have matched this up with something else that I have um, in the arsenal, but we'll see. It's not bad. Do you Different like how the shirt feels? No. Oh, you don't like how the shirt feels? No. Okay. It, it, this doesn't stretch at all. Oh, okay. So I, I'm not even sure what this material is right here. Oh, 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 it's not stretchy. Yeah, with the pants. Oh, are that's stretchy. interesting. Yeah, this is not stretched. This is I don't not know. stretchy. Right. <laughs> <laughs> but okay. So But I like you like the pants. Yes, I like yeah. the pants. Yeah, the pants look really good. Next outfit. <laughs> All right, next one. Again, I'm rocking something really casual, cute. Um at first I wasn't sure about the material, but um, I feel like with one wash or one or two washes, this is going to get really soft and really cozy. Um, I feel like this is going to be great for the fall season. I love chocolate brown for the fall. I feel like this is going to be one of my colors. Brown and green is going to be probably my fall colors for the season. So um, I'm, I'm leaning towards lots of browns and greens. And I absolutely like how this fits. It's just the right baggy enough, not too, too baggy. Um, I like how it fits. The pants fit cute and it's comfortable. It's really comfortable. And I like when sweatpants have the scrunchie at the bottom and that's how these are. So I could definitely see myself rocking this um, a lot on just a casual day. Um, so yeah, I have no complaints about this one. Well, mine is more towards the end of the summer pink mm -hmm. with the sand, sand color. Trousers. Yeah. yeah. Mm -hmm. It kind of stretch. This is a little loose, but this is a large. These are double legs, so if you have like wider legs, bigger legs, you gotta make sure that you get the larger size for. I mean, because they fit slim. They don't feel too bad. I actually like the combination of colors, but this is more towards too. the end of the summer. I like the combination yeah. of colors for sure. I never would have put them together necessarily, but I I love how it looks, and it looks really good on your skin tone. Yeah, I got good skin. 
it's, it's good. My skin tone's pretty good. It's you just say good. thank you. Next outfit. All right, next outfit. So this one um, is another little like sweatsuit set. Uh, well, not sweatsuit, I guess. Is this a sweat set? Pajamas set. Pajamas sweat set. <laughs> yeah, because it's not like thick. Uh, to me, it's not a thickness that feels like sweats. It's a wear around the house set. Right, right. It looks nice for around the house, relaxing lounge. Casual yeah, lounge casual. set. This is yeah. a lounge set. Um, for sure because it's a little too thin to be a sweat set so lounge set um, it definitely has the scrunch at the bottom on the ankles I thought it had pockets but it doesn't so no pockets on this one it does have a drawstring but it's a faux drawstring so the drawstring really isn't doing anything it's just a tie no functionality <laughs> what is going on with no functionality in the clothing flappy back it's, it's, it's a faux drawstring <laughs> it's a bow <laughs> so um, I like that it's like wider and just a really relaxed loose fit this looks like something our daughter would wear Genevieve would love this so this is probably definitely going to be gifted to her um, not super super my style but I definitely wanted to show some loungewear and um, this is this is definitely cute for for that what about yours I don't know what I was going for I think all of my stuff got mixed up but even still this feels nice soft shirt not sure what the material is stretches it does though feel soft. stretches um i do have a drawstring but it actually is a used to it. it's functional, <laughs> it's a functional it, it works, drawstring <laughs> but it's a drawstring with a i guess a dressy type of look yeah for the pants, uh -huh. which is new i think oh. they're trying to introduce this into <laughs> our culture that you know so uh, instead uh, of having a belt Mm -hmm. And it has loops for me to have a belt. Oh, so yeah, you wouldn't need both necessarily. Yeah. I wouldn't need both, but I, tell I you do that, like how it looks, though. Well, yeah, it looks casual, mm -hmm. but I'm not sure exactly. They, they come kind of short. Yeah, these are yeah. high. They're high tops. Yeah, they're definitely above the ankle. High tops. Here we go. <laughs> this is how it starts. I was just saying <laughs> the, the silliness. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. But yeah, no, I definitely feel like they should be a little bit longer. Yeah. Um, but I do like that they have pockets, they have a functioning drawstring, mm -hmm. they do have a zipper um fly. So I mean I think they're cute for sure. Next outfit. <laughs> Alright, so next outfit. We'll start with mine. I wish that you guys could see the bottoms of these. They are um what you call it? Uh bell bottoms. They're bell bottoms. Took a step forward. So, Took a step forward. I don't think they can do a step yeah, forward. Right, they won't right, be able right. to see. Oh, oh, Carol. Okay, that's not helping them to see that they're bell bottoms. <laughs> <laughs> but I appreciate you. Thank you You're very welcome. much. <laughs> so, this outfit is super, super cute. I really, really like this one. I should have got it in a small. I always get everything in a medium, but I'm learning now with these super stretchy outfits i feel like i need to just go ahead and get the small it's with yeah. stuff that isn't stretchy i need to get my real size which is in fact a medium but with these stretchy little you know um skin tight type of outfits yeah. you can really go down a size yeah. um because it, it ends up looking better when you don't have more fabric if that makes sense i think with you saying you need to go in a small with a stretchy, I need to go bigger, depending on the size. Well, I mean, for a man, know. that would make more sense, right? Because yeah. y'all have a little more going on than we do as women. Well, I, I clearly got this in the wrong size. Even oh, though really? I don't think it looks bad. You think this that's the wrong size? This doesn't stretch. You would think a hoodie would stretch. Oh, would stretch. How much is it stretching? No, it's not that much stretch, actually, no. And this is from NASA. And underneath the arms? This is, well, this this is, is from, from NASA. NASA. <laughs> this is from NASA. This is from the yeah. Air and Space Society. Yeah, 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 okay, yeah, this is yeah. from straight up NASA. Okay. <laughs> I don't think so. Maybe we can check oh, the yeah, site. Oh, yeah, we'll check it out. Yeah, we'll check the site. So if you guys want to be like a matchy matchy couple, sometimes we do that. Sometimes. Matter of fact, let's leave it up we to We don't them. always. Okay, if you guys want us to do a matchy couples haul, if you guys like to match, we like to match sometimes. Yeah. We don't always do it, but we kind of like. I think we she, likes, like to, to do she it. likes to match me because she wants to, you know, make me look 
see how he throws that out there? No, I said you want to make me look good. Oh, okay. See, look, I thought you, you was trying to finish. say I was trying to be like you. Yeah, she didn't. She didn't let me finish. Okay. Because I don't need unless, to be like unless you. Unless I say something the opposite, it would have been. <laughs> Right, anyway, girl. maybe we will do a matchy matchy couples haul. I think that could that could potentially be cute. <laughs> <laughs> so anyway, this outfit it does have a zipper closure, so you can zip it up and down. It does have I know you can't see it, but it does have like a, a lapel collar on it, but it's black, so you can't really see that part. And then I did add a belt. I know somebody's gonna ask me where's the belt from. The belt is thrifted, but I will try to find a belt like on Amazon or Shein or something and try to tag a similar belt to this one. But that also goes that you can add your own belt to it. You can your add a flair flavor. to it. But if, yeah. if you like how this, you know, 70s vibe is going. <laughs> If you like this look, then I will link right. up a similar belt in the comments. And if you guys like the hair, this wig is a part of my Glee Maid synthetic wig collection. It's not posted yet, but it will be posted probably in another week or so. I'm just waiting for more quantities to come in from my manufacturer. So if you like this wig, definitely um, follow my hair page on Instagram. Next. Oh, I like that. I do. It's interesting. Yeah. I like it. It's it interesting. It's a little different online. Oh, did it? Okay, so I wore a dress like this to an all white party that Harold and I went to, and it was from House of CB. So if you guys know anything about House of CB, you know their dresses are starting at $200. So <laughs> the dress that I wore was definitely upwards of $200. Um, and this is the pure, not like, this is the exact replica of the dress. Um, and so they don't have it in white. They only have it in this purple shade. Um, and yeah, I mean, it definitely is kind of a dead ringer. It's 90%. Yeah, it's like a, it's, it's literally <laughs> a replica dress. Yeah. Um, and sometimes I do find replicas on she in for dresses. Um, but the structure of the dress usually doesn't work out well for me. Um, but this one is actually structured pretty good. Yes. Um, the House of CB dress does have a corset in it though. So you can feel it when it zips up. It literally like zips Zip you, you up. And so when you're wearing the dress, it's it's that structure and that's what more expensive fabric more expensive tailoring all that you can feel it in the clothing the more expensive quality but this one i mean i zipped into it and i actually do feel good i feel like i am kind of sucking my stomach in the house of cb one you can kind of just chill because everything is just no matter what but i feel like if i relax in this one it's it's not as um, flattering, so I'm, yeah. I'm, I'm holding it in in this one. So you're gonna get a workout. In well, this. It, that's where the ninety percent. That's the ninety percent, but it looks like a dead ring. Is it? Yeah, I mean, yeah. and it even feels really good on. Um, purple, it doesn't feel cheap. But I was also saying, since it's purple, you look like you're in Mortal Kombat <laughs> with katana blades and all. <laughs> you see, look at Finish you. him. No? Alright, so I have <laughs> this right here. I'm not sure exactly if this is casual. It feels like a sweat hoodie, but it looks more, you know, laid back casual. This isn't bad. Um, it would be good for the fall. Great for the fall, exactly. Um, I didn't put the right pair of pants on to complement this. Maybe a casual khaki. Maybe a casual khaki or even some black slacks. You know, for the pants, and you, I think I can wear some dress shoes with this, and go to church in this. Mm -hmm. Of course, take this off. But if you're outside, you're kind of stylish. But if it starts to get local, you can throw the hood, throw the hood on. This oh, is wow. bad. Yeah, it's, 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 kinda, it's giving, it's giving you know me like Game of Thrones, yeah, type, yeah, like yeah. Jon Snow, King of the North, King of the North, That's what they call King of the North. <laughs> yeah, you can add like a like a. a uh, um, leather jacket, like a motorcycle jacket over it. I feel like this is a nice layering piece. Like you could layer it and just... Assassin's Creed. This 
But yeah, I think that's, that's, Assassin's Creed. Yeah. I think that we go for sure. A deadly couple right now. <laughs> Mortal Kombat and Assassin's Creed. Game of Thrones. <laughs> Don't mess with us right now. Let's leave that up to me. Okay, okay like sorry. Funny stuff. Okay, okay. sorry. All right. Um, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I can be funny sometimes. Yeah, I'll, I'll go change and let her finish <laughs> the rest of this haul. That's all for me, folks. Okay, cool. I have a few more pieces, so stay tuned. All right, we got the next outfit. It's actually a dress this time. Um, I really like how this fits. I feel like it's that nice bandage material that really keeps you together and keeps you feeling really you know tucked in and I love that now this arm sleeve is a little tight I'm not even gonna hold you it's tight but I like how it looks it looks really really cute and I think you can wear it in like a variety of ways if you want to this is the way I believe that it's meant to be worn with it off the shoulder but um I think you can also just raise it up and wear it like this. I think you could take this strap down and wear it um, so you can't see the sweetheart area at all. Um, you probably could take it completely down. I mean, I think there's a lot of ways you can style this. I feel like this is the cutest way with it a little scrunched here and a little open here i think this is this dress is really really cute very flattering on to the body and it fits great and the material feels great i love the color too it's um harrow saying is very retro and i like that about this so i would just throw this on with maybe just a pair of cream heels a cream color bag or you could go black i think black is a little heavy for this maybe brown shoes or a nude shoe and a nude bag would be really really cute so next one all right so for this next one a long sleeve dress you know we're going into the fall time so i think this is really really cute it's got the ruching it's got the nice split not too outrageous for the split which i actually can appreciate um a good split that's not too too crazy i love the bust area i think it's very flattering but not too much um i don't have any complaints about this dress at all actually it feels great and i love this color this color is almost a cross between like olive green and ochre yellow so it makes this really interesting gold shade um almost like an olive gold bronze uh, you didn't say brown that one time brown bronzy shade i don't know but i really really like it um it's so close to my skin tone but yet again it's not my skin tone so i think this is really pretty i would probably rock this with my um brown steve maddens i'll link them below i i have mine are from amazon but i know you can get them from the steve madden store as well I'm looking to see if they're over there, but I think they're packed because we just got back from Miami and I'm pretty sure I brought them with me. But absolutely with my Louis Vuitton bag and my brown Steve Madden Kenley um, sandals, perfect. This is a perfect look. You could wear a bunch of places and slay. So highly recommend this dress. Stretch. And it stretches, yes. This dress is very stretchy. Thank you for saying that. You, it's very stretchy. So this one is a great option. It feels very comfortable and looks looks really good. Next. This is also a Shein top, but it's not a part of this haul, but I will link it below because this is a top that I got from Shein that I wear constantly. It's always in heavy rotation at the dry cleaners. Um, these pants, fire. Um, no complaints, like no um notes about these pants these pants are everything they're satin they're like a rose color they're long enough and at shein that's saying something because a lot of times they're just not um i love the pleat at the front and i love the closure love these and they have pockets so i mean 
there's nothing bad you can say about these I would absolutely rock these with this top you can tuck it in you can wear this top open with these with a bustier underneath which is the way that I would definitely wear them um, I would wear these pants with this top open and I would have a bustier or a bralette underneath it I would not have this button buttoned but I don't have a bustier with me right now so I'm gonna do this um, fly love it you could always throw a blazer on with this this blazer is a part of this haul I'm just throwing this bad boy on real quick with this and it's a look this is definitely a look um, that I would absolutely get into um, super chic cute um, love it actually and the colors look really great together I, I, li I like this look I do and I believe I have one more for you guys so stay tuned for the last look and this is the final look I really like this set I've been eyeing this set on Shein for quite some time now of course I'm just wearing it with that same white top because I didn't go find another top but um, these pants do have a belt loop um, they are those like flounce flyaway shorts um, and this is a very loose swing fit type of jacket now I use the word jacket very loosely because this is not structured this is very light and billowy and I feel like when it was on the website it seemed like it was much more structured of a fabric it didn't seem like it was this lightweight soft flexible fabric I'll insert a picture of what it looks like on the site because it definitely didn't give me this type of vibe but I'm glad I got it because it feels great it's very lightweight very soft not sure it would be great for fall um, this is probably a much lighter summery feel but I do like it I do I, I would say I wish this was probably more bell bottoms I wish pants. these pants were, were pants mm -hmm. all, the way, down, all yeah. the way down like the previous uh, pair of pants that you had on mm -hmm. and like you said it's it's real lightweight it's, and it, yeah it's almost like a spring set like yeah, it's spring. spring. I'll say spring. Mm -hmm. That's not summer. That's spring. Not fall. No. Yeah, so it's probably a wrong season. But I do like how it looks. I think it looks really cute. And I even don't mind it styled with this white button down. So that's the end of the haul, you guys. Harold is back to say bye. Make sure you bye. guys subscribe. <laughs> you want to do the outro? Tell them what they need to do. I'm tired. Okay. <laughs> I need to go to sleep, y'all. Okay. I'm tired. <laughs> so make sure you guys hit that subscribe. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you made it all the way to the end, we, we really appreciate you guys. Hit that subscribe. Um, turn on your notifications so you never miss a new upload from us. And um, yeah, I guess we'll see you in the next one. <laughs> Bye. 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 <laughs>